Welcome back, everybody. To the yeah. Okay, maybe I'm already kind of uh, not um, keeping up the professionality, professionalism, I mean. Welcome back, everybody, to the channel. Another Switch is here in one live stream. Yes, it says professional in the title again, which means that we're going to professionally fly an aircraft again, right? Uh, we're right now on board a very special aeroplane, and of course that is ha, the magnificent, magnificent, I mean, Avrojet RJ, I think, 100 in the Swiss livery. And of course, we are... Actually, this is the R, yeah, RJ100. And we are, of course, at the birth, not, not the birthplace, but maybe like the, the home airport of the Avro. And that is pr most probably, right? Haha, <laughs> the London city, everybody. Yes, and also the Swiss livery, which, uh, oh, sorry for, yeah, great. Uh, let me actually just, wait, um, there's a thing is, um, uh, let me just say the Swiss, Swiss livery has not been, um, I'm muted. Am I muted? I'm, am I muted? That's that's gonna be horrible. Swiss. I am not muted. Stop saying I'm muted. So um yeah, Swiss um, London City. I think we all know what this is gonna mean now, isn't it? Here we go. This is the landings that we're gonna be uh, getting today. Not particularly the best. And yeah, this happened at London City here at Swiss uh, with Swiss. So yes, everybody, that is a great uh, hint into what the stream is going to be like. I uh, just wanted to. I'm stop saying I'm muted. I'm not muted. Stop saying I'm muted. It's not funny. It's not funny. It's not good. Don't say that because it's. Uh, you just don't. Just don't do that. All right. Psh, psh, psh. All right, everybody. Welcome back, indeed, aboard the Avro plane. Let's go ahead and actually just fly it around a little bit today, especially here in the Great of Britain. Um, yes, it's a f beautiful Friday evening here, at least in the in German land. Probably in the U.S. It's going to be a little bit uh, in the afternoon or something like that. Welcome back, Swiss so Air One, and let's just go ahead and now turn on the aeroplane. That's going to be quite straightforward. I hope. I guess I haven't flown this. I, I did fly this plane once on a stream, but I never did that again. Maybe for a reason I don't know because this is after all quite a realistic aeroplane of course all the switches all the buttons work as they should this is a professional aeroplane so anyway let's maybe try to get this going everybody yes a professional stream hopefully we won't have any spam donations because that will make me um, rage again and we don't want that right we, we want to be professional on here we want to stay professional on here so let's go and do that right um, right of course let's go ahead and turn on of course we won't need any any checklist for this. Yes, this is supposed to be realistic, but who needs checklists and real um, in, in in professionalism, right? We can just you know try to use like some sort of memory items, right? Things that we already know from other planes, like the batteries. There we go. Battery switch already turned on, as you can see. Some of the lights are already turning on nicely here. And now it's time, of course, as always, to turn on the auxiliary power unit. Pretty much any jet plane has it, and it's supposed to be turned on. Here we go. Start. Yes. And as you can see right here. It's starting up nicely already. APU RPM is coming up. There we go. We can already hear it here in the background. And there we go. All the engines are on. Isn't this a beautiful startup? Um, now, let's, before we do anything else, let's go ahead and can we get some... It's, this is a pretty dark cockpit. Can we get some more lights in here? This is always something I try to do um, before uh, turning on the engines. Because, like, you know, this is so dark and it's just so so depressing and so emo out here. I just wanted to make this a little bit more bright. Um, because the landings that we're going to do today are going to be emo enough anyway. So, where is... Can we find any lights? Gl dim glare shield. Okay, so that's that's one light. Uh, switch I can see. Okay. Maybe another light. Oh, yeah. Dim instruments. Yes. Yes. Is this just going to make it darker? Because dim sounds like it's going to make it darker. Has it has it gone darker? No, it doesn't. hasn't changed a single thing, has it? All right. This is a little bit more. Has it come darker or has it become... It has become a little bit brighter, hasn't it? Yes, everybody. Welcome back to professionally utilizing the lights on board the aeroplane. Can we turn this thing on? Yeah. Oh, this just... Great, we can just redirect. This is probably actually... This is probably actually the air conditioning. Great. All right, what do we also... We got Ex escape rope. Okay, that's important, of course. If we have a hijack. You know, for example, if a Swiss Zero One hater decides to board the plane and uh, hijack it. Oh, my God. Look at our co-pilot. Holy moly. That is a little bit creepy and a little bit, you know, it's, uh, I don't like, oh my god, yeah, I can understand the, the glands that this guy is 
give like look at the eyes here. I mean looking at her co-pilot. Jesus. Okay, great. Anyway. Uh what was what is the stream actually at this point? Yes, everybody. Professionalism. So all we need all that's left to do now, uh, I guess, is turn on the engines. So APU generator is already nicely turned on, as you can see right here, that's perfect. And now it's time to check if the let me check out just turn on the pumps right here. I think that's that's a good thing to do. Standby pump, turn that to on, on, I mean on, it should be, it should be on, right? So uh, put that to, don't know, something like that, something like that, I don't care. Um, DC pump. Oh, those buttons don't even press. So I'll just assume that this works. Okay, now all that's left, that's very important. Um, of course, let me just, oh, let's turn on the lights here as well. See, this is just like the thing. Just turn everything on and just hope that it works. Beacon lights, here we go, everything turn on. What's left now is, of course, the air supply. Yes, APU air is needed. And that's all we need to do. Engine air, engine air, engine air. Perfect. Out, Hello, to Tristan. They laugh at oh, me Tristan. because I am a mo. Chains, black heart, pensive face, frowning face, worried face, disappointed face, crying cat face. Frowning face, crying face, sweating face, weary face, crying face, frowning face, disappointed face. Didn't didn't we didn't we agree on not spamming? I mean you kinda did spam here with the donations, didn't ya? So great, let's turn on the plane. Okay, normal. Uh flight start. I mean no. Uh is that the one? I mean engine. Can uh, ignition. I hope that works. Okay. Yes. I hope. Wait. How do you turn this plane on? All right. So first of all, let's go and start this right here. Starter operating. Engine on. Let's see if this works. Yes. A little more power, please. Please turn the hell on, stupid plane. Seriously. Just do it. All right. Wait. We need. We need. We need. We need, of course we need uh, fuel in all of those engines. Perfect. That's good. Yes. Fine, and now I want to, the engines to turn on. Come on, engine. Yes, engine starter. Let me turn on the flight starter. Turn on! I can tell we already have a bit of an issue. So maybe start with engine four. Maybe that's gonna help a little bit. Starter operating. It is operating. It's supposed to be working, you stupid airplane. Seriously, seriously. The packs are turned on. Uh, I mean, off. Right, that's good. APU master is turned on, the APU air. Why is this not turning on? Please. <sighs> God damn, this is the problem of, you know, ha not having flown a plane for like a thousand years now. So this is the APU generator, of course, that's turned on nicely. Turn that back on, see if that works. Yes, okay, fine. And let me just try this again here with the starter. A starter operating. Start power on. Can we see? Something coming on here. No, we can't. That's just great to see. Let me try to use the initiator. Perfect. Yes. Come on, plane. Do it. Ortun donated two pounds. Hello. Hi again. Your videos are great. Keep it up. Thank you, man, Orton. Wait, that doesn't work. This plane. <sighs> right and left align. What do you mean by right and left align? There is no aligning we need to do on this aeroplane. What the hell? What, what do you mean? What do you mean? I'm confusion very much today. I have the honest master nicely turned on everything here is supposed to be like working ground ignition both on Work you stupid plane. Why is this button not even pressing? Is this normal? No engine number three pump PTU don't know what that does DC pump Work oh, I didn't turn on the fuel tr did I turn on the fuel pump normal standby pump maybe that will do something uh. Inner, outer, inner, inner, inner. Okay, let's just see. Maybe this will turn on now. Yes. Give it all we've got. Yes. No, it doesn't work. Please. <sighs> see, I've already been on the ground for like a bit of a while now, and it just won't help at all. This just sucks. Anti skid. <laughs> it just doesn't change this thing. Why won't can we even press these buttons? That's like another question that I have. Something, something about this plane is like so confusing. So, all right. Um, we tried to start off the all right. This is the start master. Let's turn it back on Right here engines engine number four starter operating Yes Why aren't you starting turning on your stupid plane? What is what is what is the trouble of yours? 
I thought this was going to be a professional aircraft. Uh, I mean, stream. Is there fuel in the plane? Oh. Well, there is some fuel. Let's check out the weight and balance. Yeah, there is some fuel. There's only no fuel in the, in the center. Let's go and add some fuel into the center here. There we go. Maybe that will give us a bit of a... Yeah, there we go. That's the center fuel. Perfect. Give me some power, you stupid plane. Jesus Christ. I mean, seriously. Engine starter, number four. It should be turning on. What am I doing wrong? Probably something with the packs. They are clearly turned off, though. So that doesn't work. Please just turn the hell on. Seriously. Zone temperature. Nah, we won't need any of that. Engine air. Maybe turn that off? Because APU air is turned on. Maybe that will do something. Maybe the it's related to the to someone that's uh, normally considered the packs. It hasn't started. Ted. It hasn't worked at, uh, at all. Come on. All right, everybody, welcome back to Swiss, Swiss Airlines. Um, oh, what is the sound? What is the sound? What is, where's the sound coming from? Help! Did something crap? What the hell was that? Was that our airplane? What, did, did that do something wrong? Is the plane broken? I think it might just... <sighs> what am I doing wrong? Seriously, tell me. Oh, no, I've turned off the APU. That's not been a good idea. Turn that all back on, please! Did you close the door? I did. Everything here is closed. That's supposed to be closed. Hmm. Alright, uh, I've turned off the APU. That's, uh, it's completely hopeless. It's all completely hopeless here today, isn't it? Jesus Christ. Control E. No, that's cheating. Start the flip. What is start the flip what? Hmm. We need to figure this out now. Guys, what did I miss? We have not missed anything. We are still on the ground. We're so starting to start up the plane. Start power. Will eighty nine hundred donated thirty dollars? A O N. Oh is your day? And by the way, love the channel. Thank you, Will eight nine hundred. Uh, oh my God! Thank you so much, dude. Uh, yeah, uh, very. I'm glad you're enjoying it. First of all, that's good. Thank you so much. Second of all, I'm very much sorry for disappointing you with the stream because it is not clearly working. I need help. I mean, in general, but like in, with flying this aeroplane. But thank you very much, dude. Um, dude, send me your Instagram account so, so, uh, so I can contact you about the Swiss Air One patch that I'm sending to everyone that donates over thirty dollars. And I want to turn on the uh, avionics. Why can I can I press most of the buttons? Auto start. I'm not gonna do that. Help! Help! Press out F4. Will that do anything? Will that do anything? Won't. It won't do anything at all. Flight start. All right, maybe that'll do something. Come on, engine starter operating. Turn on! You stupid aeroplane, what the hell is wrong with you? Nothing will work. Go to hell, you stupid plane. Seriously, why is this not working? Hold it, the engine starter. Should I hold it? Yeah, I've, I've been trying to hold it for like a thousand years now. And it won't even do anything, right? Holding it. Yeah, yeah, holding it. For how long? For how long do you want me to hold it? It just won't even turn on at all. Work! Seriously. Turn on! Continue ignition. Continue ignition. Turn on packs is like an Airbus. Should I turn on the packs? Sure. That's something you would never do. Maybe that'll maybe that'll have the maybe that'll do the trick. Right, so packs. Uh pack one, pack two. Will that help? Well, I should hope not. Because that would be weird. That's not even worked. These are you you're you're a fraud. You have not this has not worked at all. Turn on the packs. I've just turned on the frat pack. It won't even work. And maybe to try to try the engine number four. Come on, plane. Just seriously start up. Right? Yes. Come on. Full power. It won't help. It won't work. It's just broken, I guess. APU bleed. APU bleed is clearly turned on. It's called APU air, and it's turned the hell on. Zone temperature detect. Don't know what that does. 
uh, RAM error, maybe shut that because we don't even need that anyway. And this plane is just not turning on. Maybe it's actually broken. Because like by normal protocol, this should work. Well, I can try something that normally does the trick, and that is turning on. Right, 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 right. What is it? What is it called again? Start engines to running. Go. Maybe this plane is just broken. Maybe it's not me that's the problem. Please. And then when that won't even work, actually, that's like the thing. How do I turn on this plane? Look at this. Look at this fire engine, dude. He's like, "Am I a joke to you? Are we a joke to you, dude?" What the hell? What's else? What's wrong with your plane? And it's just not turning on at all. Hmm. Maybe it's not me that's the problem, as always. <laughs> Blaming other people, zero zero. Well, yeah, maybe yeah. All right. This this is a little strange though. Seriously though, why can't this plane start up itself even? Like why won't auto start even work? Like it's just it. I I I I guess this plane is a little bit broken. The thing is, there is like a new Avro here. But uh, it's like $70. I didn't see myself installing that one, honestly. All right, everybody. So let's do one last thing. And that is spawning back in to London City. But with engines running. You know, starting with engines running. Because that's the only way we can get this pl pl flame plane flown into the air today. I guess. Because it's, it's impossible to get this going on. Ah, oh, man. You guys. This is so stressful of the stream. I'm sorry. Okay. Psh, everything's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. What's up, Will? Oh, you need oh, I guess, dude, William. Uh, you need us. You need to like that. Um, oh, first of all, you need to donate two dollars for it to show up. Like it's just broken otherwise. Like you can enter a message, but it won't show up for some reason. So uh, maybe, yeah. I hope that's fine. By the way, you can I just note something right here? Can I just note something right here? Not even start uh, entering the plane, uh, spawning into the plane with the engines running could help. It's just absolutely hopeless, this plane. Maybe I spawned into the wrong one, though. Oh. Oh, I'm so stupid. I know why this didn't work. I might have spawned into the Avro that has rocket engines built in. And that obviously won't start normally. That's just completely broken. Oh my god. This is the right one with a laminar research file pad. Will 8900 donate a $2? Oh my god. My Instagram is will8900. All, right. All right, I've got it saved. Thank you very much, Will. All right, man. Uh, uh, but, mm, everything's fine. Everything's good. <laughs> We're fine. We're good. Uh, I did not spawn into the wrong plane at all. And uh, yes, um, I hope you're not doubting my professionalism at this point. We're going to do... Okay, I'm going to make this up. I'm going to make this up with some nice landings. All right? Don't worry. Right? I won't disappoint today. It's not like I ever disappoint, lol. Yes! Of course this works now, this plane. Yes. All right, everybody. Enough of just playing around and doing nothing. Welcome to London City with a beautiful Avro. Let's just see if everything works right here. Yes. I can control with my Airbus lever. I can control this... We have a safety announcement, which we don't care about. But I can literally use this lever right here to put out... Oh, yeah, the air brake. Welcome back to Mr. Zero One. Yes, indeed. The Avro is known for having a short, um, um, you know, um, short runway uh, performance, right? But at the same time, it doesn't have reverse thrust on any of its four engines, which is something I find really interesting. But instead of reverse thrust, it has this interesting air brake that you could also see uh, in that Swiss Airlines video of... Uh, at to London City, but let's go and fly this plane. All right, put the flaps, uh, put the spoilers Will back up, donated two dollars. What's up, man? Sorry for being annoying. It's XD underscore Stanley. All right, XD Stanley, no worries. It's fine. I've got it saved now. You're not being annoying, of course. Thank Captain Jenks donated What's two dollars. Hi, I was donating as Jane KPL previously, flying some regional flights with the 737 yeah. Max. Rest Hope in that peace, my everybody. MCAS won't get crazy today. How's the Avro? Wish you a non-spam evening, D, at, I was joking lol, I'll never spam here, ha. Huh? Yeah, don't spam. Talking about spam, thank you very much. Look at this, we have two safety announcements going on at the same time. Who the hell developed this aeroplane? Look at this, can you hear this? 
All right, everybody, this is a very understandable safety. And you know, it's, it's important for everyone to understand it. So why not, you know, just play two languages at the same time so we can save some time? Because we're literally taking off right now. A little bit of a delayed uh, safety announcement. I mean, I mean, I've literally had this on like a Reiner flight where they would literally, while taking off, still play the safety announcement. <laughs> All right, let's take off. Here we go. Yes, we are in the air, in the arrow. As I would like to say, and let's put those flaps up. Absolutely wonderful of a flyer. Yes, of course, we might have had a little bit of a, of a bumpy s start into the stream, right? But well, because I tried to start up and normally professionally use a plane that didn't even work for the flight simulator because I literally put rocket engines to it. We're just like, how is that even going to work? But that's just great. All right, everybody, that's just uh, good. So let's go ahead and do some interesting flying stuff with this aeroplane. Now, before we do anything else, you know what? I would like, I would like to give a little bit of, uh, what did I say? Which I would like, in order of this landing, I would like to recreate it here at London City. You can clearly see this is the Swiss Avro, and I might have just, I almost thought, I almost thought I crashed, but I haven't. Great. The thing is, what you can see here. A little bit of an homage, you can also see this air break out in mid-flight. I can see the pilots were very hopeful about this landing working out. I mean, we can put it out in mid-flight here indeed. So this, this is nice for stopping in mid-air, because this plane now stops like a champ. Look at how fast we will stop now, because we, we, I mean, we need that, because we will now come in for a bit of a landing. All right, everybody, welcome back to Swiss Airlines. For legal reasons, this is not a good representation of any airline. Why does the flight attendant sound broken? Can you hear that? Why does it sound a little bit curves? Can you can you guys agree with me on that one? Did you hear that? Dude, what was wrong with the flight? It was like, oh, what the hell was that? All right, welcome back to Swiss Air One professional stream as always. Now, um, this is just a professional flight here, landing, landing now at London City, actually indeed in honor of this other landing. So what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna land smoothly, right, to do a little bit of like, uh, you know, I like to do, let's land this plane smoothly. All right, can, uh, not like the ones, the landing that they did here. Now this is just a classical London scene we've got right here. I mean, it isn't raining, but it looks uh, quite like London City, especially here with this um, wildfire in the literal <laughs> Wasn't there like a big fire in London like 300 years ago, like in the 1800s? <laughs> Look at this shit. Wow. Now that's just great here by the flight simulator, just adding a little bit of realism. All right, everybody, let's come in for a landing. This plane actually is super nice, really, for London City, I can imagine, especially because of this air brake. Like, you can literally fly as hot and high as you want with this aeroplane. You will still be able to land because of a, this crazy air brake. And look at this. What's up, Will? Thank you for becoming a, a, a member, dude. Very much appreciate it, dude. Thank you so much. Yes, we're coming down nicely for a landing indeed here in, you know, really, with this air braking, literally come in as crappy as you want. Maybe we like this plane, because again, like, it's it's very, 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 very much nice. All right, let's put the landing down. Let's put the What am I saying? I've, I've got a bit of a stroke, haven't I? Let's take a landing. Landing. Oh, look at the DPW, DPW Escalade sound nice as well. Let's come in for a landing nicely. 1 Of course uh, this uh, I uh, deliberately landed this plane hard um, to again um remind of the interesting Swiss landing that that happened uh, back in 2009 or something like that Okay, you know what? That wasn't even hard. For 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 an Avro landing, this was not really hard indeed. All right here's the second touchdown. Also not particularly smooth. You know what? <laughs> this is the, this is like the thing. This is like an average Avro landing. I mean, comparing this to this one right here, which is pretty much a near death crash kill. Look at this scene here, right? Compare that to this right here. I mean, come on. 
Compare, compare, compare this one to, to this one, I think we've got a bit of a butter landing, in fact. Come on, stop, stop saying this is the worst landing ever. You know, it was really not smooth, but it was not, it was not all, like, death and death and, and, and suffering. Like, it's been okay. But let's take off this plane again. Let's use the rest of the runway we've got. I mean, this is probably, this plane probably doesn't need that much of a long runway to take off. Full power, yes. Let's get this going. Yes. Full power. 17 knots. 80 knots. 100 knots. Wee oui, wee. Oui. Yes, everybody, we've taken off professionally, not crashed into the construction zone. That's just great to see. Everybody, welcome back to Swiss Zero One. We are professionally flying here again, as always, as you would expect. Let's go ahead and we have these little, little cable, call, what's it called? What do you call them? Like lifts? Well, yeah, zero X donated right two here. pounds. Yeah. You can always go around. Oh, we might have just crashed into the cables. Well, you're right, Verox. I didn't do that, though. Let's check this out right here. Come on, I'll do a little bit of a stun here between the buildings. Yes. Pilot Ludi oh, donated $2.51. Do PSA 1771 flight challenge. What's PSA 7071? What's that one? Please, what is, what is that one? Did I, did I crash into the cables? Let me check, actually, this one. I think this was a quite a nice stunt. Holy moly, that was very close to absolute death and failure. But I think we didn't hit anything, did we? All right, so this is actually the stunt where I think I did hit something here. This uh, cable thing. Did I hit anything here? I didn't. Why did the flight simulator act up? Can you see that? It, 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 it acted like I crashed into something. I did not, all right? This is what we call fake news here. Oh, God. All right, next up. Next up. Shh, calming down. Calm down. Let's check out this London uh, stunt. I think this is this is actually also quite nice. All right, good one. Okay, almost almost crashed into a building though. That was probably one of the closest stunts I've ever done. Look at that. Yes. Check this out. Right here's this bank angle, flying between those buildings and almost hitting this one right there. But I didn't. I didn't. This was an absolute make, um, good stunt. Immaculate, as they call it here in. Uh, London. I don't know why I, did. I just said that. All right, everybody. But we do, do we, we we do have one thing that I want to achieve in life. This is of course a smooth landing in the Avro. Cause I mean, yeah, the the last landing we did was absolutely bad and just tr trash. And let's maybe try to land here now. We've got London Heathrow ahead. Not a runway that is like absolutely ridiculously long, just like London City. This is now a proper normal airport for a change, right? And I would like to really use this now. Use this nice long runway to perform a good landing here with the Avro. I mean, I literally make, made a different video about the Avro being hard to land. Let's maybe try this. Adventures of Jackie Boy donated $4.99. Guess who's back? Swiss. The legend of Jackie Boy. He's always here. I don't know how you do it. How do you seriously? How do you never miss a stream? I think it did. Did you? I think you did. Might have missed a stream once or twice. But still, you're you're like super active. That's just great. Right, let's come in for a landing right here. We are at, at, at a nice speed. We're coming up for a landing here. The trimming works nicely on this aeroplane as well. Yes. I mean, it's so sad that this plane is mostly dead now, isn't it? I mean, yes. It's got four engine and it's. Uh, the Mercedes G-Class is probably more efficient, but that doesn't matter. What we've got right here is a beautiful four-engine aircraft without any reverse thrust. But it's very quiet of a plane. Because those engines are so small, it's very easy to make it extremely quiet, I think. Uh, it's also sometimes um, referred to as the Whisper Jet, this plane. And I think that very much uh, makes sense. Oh yeah, look at the screen wipers. Look at that. That's nice. Put them off again, please. All right, let's get rid of the spoiler or the air brake here, and let's get the plane landed. And when I say landed, I mean, of course, a butterly. Yes, I'm very professional out here today. We've got the car park that we're almost crashing into, but this is professional indeed. All right, runway coming up. Of course, every good landing starts with a good approach, and this approach now is a lot, lot smoother and better than the one we did in London. See, just keep up the speed. This is looking good. Flaps are all down and ready. Everything here is good. Let's get this landing performed. Ah, uh, you know, I still don't have 100% of this fuel. Let's try this anyway. Come on, yes. What's up, man? 
Will 8900 donated $2. Quick question are you going to get X Plane 12? Of course I am. Holy moly, this is the worst plane ever. I mean, I like this one, but why does it land so hard? Oh my god. We didn't... Okay, good. We saw nothing. We did. We saw nothing. Everything is good. Uh, let's land this plane again nicely, all right? We don't want to stall out onto the runway. We are stalling out... Oh my god. Alpha Jamis donated two pounds. Hey, Swiss, you having a good day of streaming. Mm-mm. 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 I like how the safety ha <laughs> the safety not but it's still right. <coughs> Sorry it's all the smoke coming into my lungs. Oh my god. <laughs> I, I do have to admit that one. I was very Ryanair. Jesus Christ. Oh Oh, that was a proper stall. That was a landing. That was a very bad one. Check out the one Ooh, that was also not good. Oh shoot. We've died. I do have to still master this aeroplane, especially landing it. Jesus Christ, that's been so bad. Oh, bang, ding, ow. I mean, we can compare that to, to this landing right here, right? Look at that. It's much better. You know what, actually? I think I think this landing, or the hardness of it, comes quite close to the to ours. Uh, look at that. Uh, wait, let's see this again. Honestly, I think there's a little bit of similarity to that one. Let's check this out right here. Come on. Uh, and honestly, seriously. KK two hundred ten donated five pounds. Hi, I going? literally just got back from Jamaica today this morning. Jamaica? Did you just see me, Jamaica? I hope you had a great time, man. Welcome to the stream. And what the hell? I mean, seriously, this landing of the smoothness like can get. I, I think it's very similar here to the smooth. Look at this. I think we can compare this. Look. I think this has been all right. You know, totally professional landing. Let's maybe check out another one. Uh, I mean, we've got, uh, what have we got right here? RIF Nordholt. Let me just come in for a landing here in this Avro. This is just absolutely bad. <coughs> Alpha James donated two pounds. Some Alpha James will come. Swiss Hope or good also, you missed my first donation. I didn't actually miss it uh, you were talking about uh, have a good stream today or something like that and I didn't and I, I said no I was just absolutely hopeless uh, I'm not having a good stream because this is all just bad COVID stop saying COVID all right <clears throat> I might just have COVID but I've, I've been vaccinated twice don't know what's gonna happen with me no, seriously, I don't know. I, do I have COVID? Maybe I do have COVID. Yeah, actually, that's like the thing. It's, 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 the, thing about, it's the thing about being vaccinated, right? It's just, it's just kind of protects you from hard it's like symptoms, right? From a hard uh, um, hard hit of, of COVID, right? When you do get it. Um, but like, I don't know. I guess it's useful. COVID-001. Stop saying COVID-001, dude. It's just not not the case <laughs> at all. I hope I guess. Uh, good. On that one, oh, sorry. Let's get this plane landed. I hope, hopefully smoothly. So, what I can tell, I can tell a bit of a pattern in all of these bad landings, and it's a very low speed. 
And there are, again, two safety announcements running at the same time. See, the thing is, most of the time when you land this plane hard, it's because it's stall above the runway and just fall onto it like a rock. There you go! That looked much better now, didn't it? Alright, put the fire brakes out, let's get this plane stopped quickly. Here we go! This looked now a lot, lot better here. Not stalling out on, on the runway, I think that's gone very well. We did use minimal runways well. That was good, I think. What do you guys think? <laughs> the safety now is just absolutely annoying, it's gonna keep playing it. <sighs> Stop! Look at that! That's actually been alrighty, wasn't it? Let's check this out right here. I didn't have the air brake out here on top, but that doesn't matter. Let's check this out. I think I, I, I did a nice, like, long, yeah, like, the touchdown itself was, in the end, not the extremely smoothest of the butters. But right, this is now a lot, lot better than the previous one. I think this is actually okay, right? This has been okay. I think this has been alright, right? Stop complaining. Stop com <coughs> Stop complaining, it's all fine. We've just, we've just survived this, right? So maybe, maybe, you know what? While we're at it, you know, since since we are in London now, after all, I do want to try this again. London City, where's London City, dude? There's so many weird airports here um, around London. Why? Why are there so many airports? We only need London City practically. I mean, you can fly 777 here. Okay, let's maybe try London City again. I really want to master the landing here, okay? Shh, it's been fine. Now load! Seriously, load. Load yourself, please. When will you load, you stupid flight simulator? Just go. Here you go. Yes. It's loading. And I'm on my phone right now, if you can tell. Just checking out what's what's up right here in the world of Swiss is your one, everybody. That's just all we want and all we need. What am I saying? Ah, what's up, man? Why is this loading for you so long? I don't know. Alright. Yes, we have the safety announcement. We might just want to turn that off. Now, it's time to absolutely calm with very gentle fingers. Get this aeroplane landed. Put the flaps down. Get everything ready here. And now, it is time to come in for a landing right here. You know, speed brakes are good. Let's put the landing guard down. That would have almost been a very much death if I hadn't put it down. And now London City. Are you ready for absolute butterization? Seriously, Runway, you haven't seen a landing like that in a long time. And look at that bridge in the back. I do have quite the urge to land this plane there now. Let's do that later on. But first of all, it's time to land this plane smoothly. And we're now exactly entering that exact same pattern that we have done for the last few thousand flying landings. What am I saying? We need to fly. We, didn't, we need to land a little bit faster. 140 knots is look, looking nice. Just in order not to stall out. All right, let's get this plane landed. The safety is so annoying. Twi oh, my God. All right. Shut up! Have any questions about our flight today? Please Damn. don't hesitate. All right, good. Thank you. All right, good. Now it's time to stop. Full power. I mean, no full power. There is no reverse thrust. So literally nothing you can really stop with. The only thing you have is this good air brake system. And I think that's worked though. I think that's been all right. Was that good? It was not the, the most The amazing Brady donated so, three dollars. Hey Swiss, have a good stream and let's use this bay 146 septum decillion 146 six decillion 146 quindecillion 146 quatuor decillion 146 tree decillion 146 duo decillion 146 soon decillion 146 decillion 146 nonillion 146 octillion 146 septillion 146 sextillion 146 quintillion 146 146 quadrillion 146 trillion 146 billion 146 million 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 146 